Good day guys. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be looking at how to make money during the NBA Awards promo. Uh, I'll start with the simplest method. It's probably not the most effective, but it'll get the job done. Uh, and there's not too many sets that we can dive into at this stage until they start to release a little bit more content. So you are, you are a little bit limited. So what you want to do is select the NBA Awards program filter. And then we're just going to be setting a max value of let's say seven seven thousand five hundred at this point in time and you're just going to be sniping golds obviously the drops coming every five minutes there's a fair chunk of, uh, of gold that are coming out the ah is a little bit bugged at the moment which means that sometimes you're going to miss a drop sometimes you get a drop early so it's it's a bit weird but uh, that can help you get uh, get some golds that others might not see um, you can see that there's quite a few each drop and if you can get one or two of those at the moment they're selling pretty much instantly for about 17 18k on auction house 3 which is my auction house so if you if you're getting those for 7k let's say and you're reselling at 17k minus the auction house fees you're making just over 8k so you're doubling your money each time you manage to snipe and sell one of those but keep in mind that as the promo goes on and new packs come out uh, the cost of golds will eventually drop. So if you're going to be using this method, this is something you want to be doing uh, sooner rather than later. Uh, so the next thing to look at is your daily objectives. So the daily objectives reward gold and elite calendar items. The elite calendar item is for completing all of your daily objectives. And if you complete the daily objectives seven times in a row for a week, then you can actually redeem a free 91 plus NBA Awards Elite. So just grind. That's going to be the simplest way to make money because not only are you going to be uh, grabbing a free Elite, you'll also get access uh, to a free NBA Awards nominees pack. That's once a day because there's five of the daily objectives that give you these gold calendar tokens. So once a day, you'll be able to redeem one of these packs. If you get lucky, you'll pull an elite in those packs, but if not, you're at least gonna get a gold, which at the moment, as I said, is selling for 17K. You're also, by grinding these objectives, going to be doing the standard and the extreme live event. Now, at this point in time, the extreme live event is very achievable. When the promo was first live, it was a very hard three-point contest, but this one is just a, a make five dunks out of five attempts. So if you have a, a player with a decent dunk rating, this is the most efficient way to be getting the collectibles. So you can see here that it costs five stamina, but you'll be getting three NBA awards envelopes. So let's go through, um, I've been doing this with 99 over Kevin Durant. He hasn't missed a dunk for me yet. Let's hope the, that he doesn't miss his first one on camera. So let's just clearly smash out the five dunks that's required. So the difficulty with this event is that you can't miss a dunk. If you miss a single dunk, you've failed the event. You have to hit all five. Most of them are pretty easy. The only slightly awkward ones are the ones from the side. So you just have to pay a little bit more attention and make sure you get those. So as you can see here, there we go. Five out of five. Really didn't take that long. It's much quicker than the three-point contest. Much easier than the three-point contest. But the efficiency in terms of envelopes per stamina is much better than the basic event. So we've just got three envelopes and then you're redeeming those for these two sets here. So every 10 hours, you can redeem five of them for a gold player. Once again, sell them as soon as possible, 17K a pop, a little bit more if you're willing to risk a longer sell time. And then if you have extras, then you pop them into this set to do the same. And that's what I've been doing. I've just been selling the golds um, grinding for these daily objectives. I haven't been sniping golds myself uh, just because it's a little bit time consuming but if you really need some money and if you've got some time to sit in the auction house then you can really easily double um, each each gold you snipe you can essentially double your money if you're sniping it at seven and a half K or below. So at this point in time guys they are the best methods of making money during this promo. EA have said that new players will be coming out uh, there's obviously the LeBron James set, which, which requires award winners. We don't know who they'll be until that's announced on the 26th, but I, I would assume that the award winners will be redeemable by their own sets. So then there'll be some more money-making methods that, uh, that will be available. So good luck, guys. I hope you've 
got the ability to make some cash during this promo. All promos are really good um, methods of making money. Um, actually, the last thing I'll touch on before I go, it's worth having a look at the new players that come out that replace or are better than players in the, the existing positions. Uh, so one example, for instance, uh, would be Steph Curry, 93 over shooting guard in the shooting lineup. So just have a look at what players other people might start selling to replace them with that new Steph Curry. And if there's one player that really stands out, then you might actually get a snipe on that particular player. So that's not necessarily a promo player, but it's related to the promo. So if you use your smarts and you have a look, jump on nbalive.gg and check out all the players in those positions, similar over, maybe similar three point rating or defensive rating, depending on the position. Um, that, that can be a, another way to make money if, you, if you're a little bit clever and you put some thought into it. So good luck guys. Hope this video was useful. If you enjoyed it, as always, please like and subscribe and make sure to check back for new content.